Hi YouTube, I am back with another video tutorial on VI Editor. This is in continuation of my previous uh, previously shared video where I had uh, talked about the basics in VI Editor and I promised that I will come up with another video which will be having the, the remaining or the, the extra stuff that you should know in VI. Okay? If you haven't seen my previous video, please see it in my tutorial <coughs> in my in my channel okay so yeah so let's uh, go with some more uh, activities that is really important in vi so yeah so let's explore all these options okay so let's say i will take one again i'll take a few files i'll talk about and then i can it will be easy to understand okay so let's say i want to i want to show you uh, how to open a file how to open more than one file or how to open how to open more than one file at a same at the same time and edit and, and work on them or how to open a file in a difference mode or how to uh, run some commands inside vi editor okay so we'll talk about these things let's say let's say i want to open two files in a difference mode in a diff mode so you can give uh, vi minus d space the file name I have another file, this another. So it will open the two files in difference mode. So it will show you the two files with the the whatever difference is there between the two files. It is it is similar to uh, uh, Vim diff. Okay. So it will open the files plus it will show you the difference between the two files also. Okay. <coughs> Let's say. I'll, I'll, I'll open you one more I'll open this one more time okay so you see um, this is my first file and this is my second file okay there is nothing in this file fine fine so this is the one option to open the two files in different mode next okay now, now I'll talk about how we can open more than one file in a, in the same window okay let's not uh, open the same window okay uh, let's open in uh, in the same window with the uh, with all the files in the same screen okay one by one okay so if i if i use vim and give the file names i can open more than one file at the same time see one file is open but it will show you only one file at a time if you want to go to the next file you have to press colon next it will take you to the second file again if you press colon n it will take you to the third file okay right so this is how you can open the three files at the same time you can do your editing you can you can come out okay fine if i want to open the three or four files in the same window then i have to use the option called minus o okay let's open the three files again at the same in the same window okay so if i give minus o lower case o it will open the three files in in the same window in a horizontal manner okay so you can do whatever editing you want to here okay and then press escape if you want to go to the next line next file you can press colon and enter okay here it is asking you to save your changes okay let's say i want to save this okay fine now i want to go to the next file so this is your next file okay again i want to go to the next file this is your third file okay so this is how you can navigate from one file to another using colon n when the files are open in horizontal fashion okay to come out of the files you press colon q every time to come out of this okay. now you see uh, this was the case when i had to open the files in uh, <coughs> in horizontal manner stack stacks stack order okay if i want to open the files vertically so i have to give i have to use capital o let's give the three files okay fine i'll use the capital o option so it will open the three files in 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 vertical 
visual okay so here you can it's the same thing you can do whatever you want in this one again you if you want to go from this uh, to this again second portion you have to you can use either you can use colon n to go to the next file so you are you are in the next file if you want to come back to the previous file colon capital n it will bring you to the first file okay <coughs> now it is allowing you to open the same file uh, in the leftmost portion okay let's say i want to go to the second portion and edit there itself not in the first portion so i can use control w and then right button just notice what i'm saying i'm pressing control w and then the right button it is taking me to the next next editor okay i i saved it if i want to come back to the previous uh, vertical uh, portion press control w and press left okay i am here in the middle one i can do my changes i can save my changes again if i want to come back to my previous the first portion i can do control w left button or control w right button to go from one one screen to another right so this is a difference so you must have uh, noticed the difference between colon n upper n and lower n and the the control w keys okay so if i press colon n i will the second file will open but in the same window and if i press colon capital n again i'm coming back to the previous file right the only the first portion is the leftmost portion is active but if i, I actually want to go to the second or uh, the third uh, vertical portion i have to give control w and then right so i'm here now control w right i'm in the third section so you can do editing whatever and then come out of it okay so again if you want to quit press colon q first one is closed colon q second one is closed and then the last one third one is closed so this is how you can open multiple files okay so uh, what else is left i think i have covered most of the things let's uh, okay so this is my file so i think most of the things are captured so there are some more things like okay if you want to go to the bottom of the file you should press shift g to take you to the bottom of the file okay if you want to go to the top of the file you have to press colon 1 it will take you to the first line if you want to go to a certain number of line of the file if you want to go to a certain number of lines of the file so you can press colon 50 okay it will take you to the 50th line right so i think i have covered all the things so if there is something left i'll come up with another video okay so that's all guys for now thanks for watching thank you